Red Star shot and killed off a of Garden Highway. I ain't no bro like that. But we talked through DMs. Like, we were supposed to do an interview. Because, like, he an MMA fighter. That's the shit he was into, and that's the shit we was talking about. He did a lot of time. He probably a little older than me. He originally from Valley High, but he from Stars and all that shit. But it wasn't about that when we was talking, you know? He seemed like a genuine person. We used to chop it up about a lot of shit. And he will, you know, give his take on my videos when I, like, earlier started and critique certain things, and, you know, and uh, just give more insight on just music and just entertainment and things of that nature. So I will put a link in the description of, you know, his MMA fights. And he just seemed like a genuine person. It wasn't about gang shit. It was about entertainment, you know, and he was giving me pointers on things and, you know, bring more rappers to the light from South Sac that I probably didn't hear of or overlooked and things like that. That was where I respected that. So we used to talk you know, here and there and shit through DM. And that says a lot, you know, for him. Just for, because we're not, he's not my enemy. I never met the guy, you know. But just on some street shit, you know, motherfuckers don't see eye to eye as far as like, you know, our hoods and all that shit. But that's through third parties and all that shit when you really think of it. So for, for him to tap in and you know, appreciate what a nigga doing and not being biased, you know, that was respected, bro. So he, he, gave, he gave my respect for that, you know, and I believe I gained his respect. But uh, it's a sad tragedy, you know, shot and killed, car wrecked and all type of shit. You know, uh, he had a family, so condolence to his family, his kids, and things of that nature. The nigga did a lot of time for robberies and and all type of shit, you know. That's the shit that we used to talk about, because, you know, motherfuckers did time, too. So we used to just talk about just different things outside of just street politics and shit. So I repeated that, man. You feel me? And uh, it's just crazy, man. A lot of shit going on, man. But, you know, that don't take the genuine heart from a person, like politics and all that shit, especially when they see a person trying to do positive things. But like I said, he was an MMA fighter. He got a fight on uh, YouTube and he was into, you know, I believe into kind of like the blogging shit, but he wasn't a blogger. He was doing interviews with different people. So he was trying to get his own name out there, you know? And he never asked for a story. He never asked for none of that type of shit. You know, when he, he didn't feel like it, it was just about him. He was just giving pointers on, you know, his side of the field and just rappers and entertainment and he seen I was where I was going with this shit. So, you know, I pity that man. It's fucked up, man.